Hi guys, welcome back to the Mama Mixer. I'm Sarah from Sensational Finds and today it is time for another video. And this video is going to be a fun video because I'm going to do the first tag that we've ever done on the Mama Mixer. I'm going to do my first time tag and you ask a random questions of your first time. So it's a fun way for you guys to get to know me a little bit better and we can just get to know each other a little bit better, you know? If it is your first time watching the Mama Mixer, please hit that subscribe button right here so that you can join our little YouTube family. If you guys want to get to know me a little bit better, just keep watching. Okay, so are we ready? Are we get ready to get a little bit more personal with Sarah? I think so. So it says, my first tweet. And I have no clue when my first tweet was. I had an old Twitter account that I locked myself out of. Don't you guys hate when that happens when you can't remember a password? So I locked myself out of an old one. I think it was probably like, I don't know, 2010, 2011? I have no clue. My first YouTube video. So I used to, here's a little fun fact, I had a really old YouTube channel from like years ago when Bobby was a little tiny baby. I think I made like two videos. They were terrible, horrible lighting, and I just never went back to it again. I just always watched YouTube. But my first official YouTube video was, let's see, let's, let's bring up a date. Can we bring up a date? And it was the all amazing channel intro. <laughs> and um, it, that was on August the 26th, 2014. So we are coming up on one year of consistently doing videos, which is really exciting. First person you subscribe to on YouTube, I have no clue. It was probably Dulce Candy or something. I used to watch her years ago, probably in like 2009. When I first started watching YouTube, um, I watched her and she was probably the first person I subscribed to, but I have no clue. Um, my first pro, my first Facebook profile picture is this one. When I first started doing Facebook, I had no clue what I was doing. I was like so old on Facebook and I remember my husband, he was like telling me like, your pictures aren't supposed to go there. I can think I was putting them in like the profile section. So uh, I was old. I'm, I'm too old. <laughs> too old to be starting Facebook. Okay, do you still talk to the first per to your first love? Of course I do because my husband is my first love. Um, what was your first alcoholic drink? And I remember the first time I ever got drunk, I got drunk off Mad Dog 2020 and Alizé. Oh my gosh. I was so sick, barfing everywhere. That was, oh, oh my gosh, never and never again will I ever drink Mad Dog 2020. What the heck was I thinking? What was your first job? So my first job was at Annie Ann's Pretzels. I worked there and I was a cashier. Um, and I also, it was like conjoined with Coors Brothers, which is like an ice cream store. And I used to make the ice cream and make the pretzels. And that was like the best job ever. What was your first car? My first car was a 1988 Honda Civic with the flip out lights and it had a sunroof and I got a stereo, like a custom stereo put in there and I was 17 years old and you could not tell me nothing. I thought I was so cool. I just thought I was like the coolest and I really wasn't and I crashed it, ran into the back of somebody. <laughs> um, who was the first person to text you today? Probably my husband. Who was the first person you thought of this morning? Probably myself as I got up and got ready for work. Is that selfish? Um, who was your first grade teacher? And I believe my first grade teacher was Mrs. Pike. <laughs> Where did you go on your first ride on an airplane? And I remember going to St. Louis, Missouri for this youth conference when I was in high school and that was my first time ever on an airplane. Who was your first best friend and do you still talk? So I have been or I was best friends with the same person through all of my entire life. Her name was Christina and we were really good friends up until about 2011 and we just ended up not talking anymore so no we do not talk anymore where was your first sleepover and I can remember going back in my head I can remember how it was like a sleepover party at a girl named Nicole's house and I remember I like bumped my head and my mom did not want to let me go but it was like my first sleepover ever and I cried and cried and cried until they let me go and I was like late to the sleepover party you guys can remember being a girl and like ha missing the sleepover party you would have been the odd man out I was so upset I think I was probably like about six six or I don't even remember how old I was 
I was young. What was the first thing you did this morning? I got up and got dressed and got ready for work. What was the first concert that you went to? The first concert that I ever went to was, I believe, the one that I can remember is Jessica Simpson. Oh, this was like, what, oh, I don't know. When I graduated high school, I went to the Jessica Simpson concert and I was so excited. Uh, maybe I went to other ones, but that's the only one I can remember. First bone you broke, I never broke a bone, thank God. But I, my first piercing was my ears, and I got those done when I was probably, I don't know, 10 years old? I don't know. We had to wait a really long time to get any piercings. The only other piercing that I ever had was my nose, and I have let that close up since. First foreign country you've ever gone to, the only foreign country I've ever gone to was Italy when I was 15, but I have high hopes of getting to another one really, really soon. The first movie you remember seeing, I have no clue. I can't even remember. I have no clue what first movie. I don't know. I can't even think of anything. Probably like something Disney. What was the what was your first detention? And I think this was in like elementary school. I remember the teacher made me stay after school. It was in second grade. She made me stay after school and find all these little paper pieces that you needed for counting. And I remember crying and my dad coming in to get me because she held me after school to find all these little pieces of paper that you had to learn how to count and do adding and subtracting. It was terrible. I was like trauma from that. I remember my first detention ever. It was so sad. Who was your first roommate? Uh, my husband? I have no clue. I've never had any roommates except for my sister. Um, if you had one wish, what would it be? If I had one wish, it would be to live in a really big house with a really big yard. That's the thing that I've been trying to envision the most for our family. So hopefully this wish will come true very, very soon. Um, what was the first sport you were ever involved in? And that was probably like basketball when I was a little kid in junior varsity. I used to play basketball in uh, elementary school. What is the first thing you do when you get home? probably go pee. As soon as I come in, I like go to the bathroom. I don't know why, but I always go pee as soon as I come in the door. And when was your first kiss? I think my first kiss when, was when I was probably like 12. I don't remember. I was older, like not like a little girl. I was like, I don't know, 12 or 13. I don't remember exactly how old I am, but I remember that it was in the rain and it was so gross. <laughs> Um, those are all of the questions. I tag you guys. I tag my fellow Mama Mixer ladies and I tag you guys that are watching. Check out the description box if you want to see the questions. I would love to see all of your guys' first. Let me know in the comments down below something about you. If you guys aren't subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button because it would make us so, so happy. The Mama Mixer is on a little hiatus from our live hangouts, but we will be back in August and we are doing our videos every Friday, so we will see you guys next Friday. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in our next video. Bye guys. That is so gross, Mom. What is so gross? Why? Let me face it.